In this video, I'm going to show you how to create white and varnish layers in Adobe Illustrator. First, we're going to go to our swatches palette and we have to rename our color white and give it a different name. I'm going to call it old and click OK. Then we're going to create a new swatch, call it white. Select spot color, and give it any CMYK value. I like to do 100% cyan. Then we're going to do the same thing for varnish. Call it Varnish with a capital V and I'll give it a 100% magenta value. Now we're going to create a new layer. Call it white. And we're going to select our art file. Edit. Copy. And paste it into the white layer. Edit. Paste in place. And we're going to change the spot color white. I'm going to do the same thing for varnish, a new layer, call it varnish. Select our artwork, edit, copy, and paste it in place and paint it in varnish. Now I would like to have only 50% varnish coverage. So to change that, we're going into our color palette. We're going to change it to 50%. And then we have to go into our attributes palette and select overprint fill. Now for our white layer, we also have to select overprint fill in our attributes palette. And then I want everything to have a white underbase except of the number five. So I'm going to delete the white which was on the number five. So now we have our artwork here on, on layer one. Then we have our white layer, which is all white except of the number five. And then we have varnish on top of the whole artwork, which has 50% coverage only. Next step is save the file and load it into Epson Edge Print. You'll select here triple layer and we can see here's our white layer without the five our color layer and our varnish layer which is half transparent at 50% density and that's it